Hmm, you're back. You left in a hurry last time. I is everything okay? Uh, would you mind taking part in a little experiment with us? An experiment? That came out of nowhere. I'm listening. Could you make a wish? You want me to make a wish? Is that a new sub zeros festival? Less questions, more wishing! Okay. My wish. My wish. Um, okay. I'm a little nervous saying this out loud, but I want Miss Dunyarzad to be- Oh. I noticed earlier that she looked a bit down, and she wasn't really talking. She just doesn't seem like herself. She's always so gentle and kind, and all the kids love her. I've also wondered if the reason she asked me to be Ferris Knight of Flowers is because I- So, you have a crush on Dunyarzad? Uh, <laughs> oh, is it that obvious? When she placed the hat of the Knight of Flowers onto my head, sh what she didn't realize was that I'm not that Okay, yeah, that was a bit much. Felt like the right moment to get it off my chest, but... <clears throat> okay, I'm ready to make my wish. I would like Miss Dunyarzad to appear in front of me right now with a smile on her face. Here goes. Please come true. I'm gonna open my eye. Oh! You- What? Fucky! Uh, sorry, but only one- <laughs> uh, Nice try, you two. Uh, guess he isn't the host of this dream after all. Should have expected it wouldn't be this easy. It seems like everyone who knows Dunyar is on love- My lady, step back. That sounds like Dia! Oh- Huh? But Dia can handle them! Hey, Traveler! Oh, it's you. Great timing. Please take... Hey, this is my job. The homie Yanni's pay me, not you. You... Ugh, fine. Anyway, watch yourself. So you got yourself some backup. Speed of light. Come. Stabilize. No more Shadows of the beast. I will have order. I swear by my sword. Traveler? 
Were you just taking your anger out on those guys? <sighs> you and Nahida both. Didn't... Oh, and speaking of... Remember how during the first Sub-Zero's festival, before the... Sub she said it was because she had forgotten something. Okay, so Paimon's memory is working so far. Anyway, Paimon also remembers that she is staying somewhere around here. She pointed it out to us the night before this. Yeah, even if it. This is the place. It's rude to. Hey, the windows are unlocked. Okay. Uh, Paimon's gonna. temporary residence, so there was pretty much nothing inside except this Should we open it? wrote all of this. Even though she was also busy preparing for the sub festival, she must have wanted to give this to us as a gift on the day of the sub- If we hadn't found this book, we- But now that we know, we can't even think- Hey! Where are you off to now? That's puppet. Traveler. You must be exhausted. Come to think of it. We've been stuck in this place for a really, really long time. Heck, even the last time we were chatting happily with Dunyarzad feels like an eternity ago. still remembers when we were sitting here and the way her eyes sparkled when she talked about Nilu's dance of there will always be frustrations in life that was what the real Dunyarzad said wasn't it does that mean yes traveler what is it so she's still just a puppet. But just now, how come... What? Where are we going this time?
If you continue to resist, we will have the Grand Say. Oh. Uh, traveler? Uh, you don't have to get involved. Traveler? Traveler? What the heck are you doing? If you... Wait, they're not reacting. Have they been scared stiff? Oh, of course. If this is the sage... So they're j what is this? What happened to the Grand Sage and his entourage? <laughs> like I said, they said Yes. The Greater Lord brought forth new Patisaras in memory of the Goddess of Flowers. shade of purple or, but didn't you just say all the real flowers went to extinct after yeah what's going on here uh, uh huh you guys are acting weird hmm told us people assume there will be food on a plate and Nilu assumed there would be real patisaras in the flower pots so when you saw the flowers you instantly knew it was Nilu but if we want to end the samsara we need the host to become aware that they're dreaming how should we make Nilu realize that am I dreaming So I'm right. Is this Lesser Lord Kusanali responding to our celebration of the Sabzeru's fest? Wrong guess, but you aren't completely wrong either. The point is, what made you think this is a dream? As far as you know, people in Sumeru don't dream, right? Yeah, but have you heard the tale of the First Sage? To prevent a calamity, he went on a journey to find- Ooh, sounds familiar. Dinyarzad told us a story like that when we first arrived in Sumeru City. S yep, but in the part you heard, he hadn't become the first sage yet. There's more to- His piety and wisdom were acknowledged by the Dendroarch. All kinds of spectacular scenes appeared in front of the first sage. As if all the knowledge in the world was being painted onto a canvas right before him. He was captivated. After who knows how long, he mastered all the knowledge he could comprehend. Afterward, he said to the Dendro Archon, I miss my parents, my wife, the Dendro Archon smiled. The next second, the sage found him, his wife lying next to him said, You're off to search for the Dendro Archon today, aren't you? In the end, the first sage took care of many disasters in Sumeru City and founded the Academia. So, the first sage was dreaming ever since the beginning of the story? He never went on his journey? Yes, but his faith and determination were conveyed to the Dendro Archon, so she blessed him in the form. Hyman understands where you're coming from now. That's a really interesting connection. I see. Well, it just so happens that today's sub -Zero's festival is almost over too. Since we're in a dream, let's make this final dance of sub -Zeru's as beautiful as we can. <laughs> the wait is over, everyone. I dedicate this to our god, the dance of sub -Zerus.
I'd be lying if I said I had no regrets. I would have loved to see Nilu's dance. Feels like she's been asleep for the longest time. Paimon's head feels super heavy. Did we oversleep? Do you even remember going to sleep last night? Paimon thinks it was after the Sub Zero. The Sub Zero's festival! Traveler and Paimon, and thank you, Dunyarzad, for organizing the Subzeros Festival for me. I'm sorry, who are... Dunyarzad! <laughs> oh, a uh, Traveler, Paimon. I have some... I just had a dream. And I saw Nilu performing the dance of Subzeros. Thank you. 